In the heart of the mist-shrouded mountains, nestled among ancient pine trees and moss-covered rocks, there stood a serene monastery. It was home to Master Ren, a venerable Zen master known for his wisdom and enlightenment. One day, a young and eager disciple named Akira arrived at the monastery, seeking guidance on how to improve himself every day. Master Ren welcomed Akira with a warm smile. Ah, young one, you've come seeking the path of self-improvement. Sit, and let me share a tale that will illuminate the journey you are about to embark upon. As the fire crackled in the stone hearth, Master Ren began to weave a tale of a wise old tortoise named Hikaru. Hikaru roamed the mystical forest of tranquility, a place where the trees whispered ancient secrets to those who listened with an open heart. Hikaru, much like you, sought to improve himself every day, the master said, his eyes gleaming with ancient knowledge. He discovered that the key to growth lay in embracing change. In the forest of tranquility, the trees shed their leaves in the autumn, letting go of the old to make way for the new. Likewise, you must learn to release the attachments that hinder your progress. Akira listened intently, absorbing the wisdom of the ancient tale. Master Ren continued, to improve oneself is to cultivate a beginner's mind. Just as the river flows, never stagnant, so too must your mind be open to new experiences and insights. The tortoise learned to navigate the ever-changing currents of the forest, adapting to the twists and turns of life. The master paused, allowing the crackling fire to punctuate the silence. Now Akira, close your eyes and imagine the forest of tranquility. Feel the cool breeze, hear the rustle of leaves, and envision yourself letting go of the burdens that weigh you down. This is the first step towards self-improvement. With closed eyes, Akira embraced the imagery, visualizing the metaphorical shedding of old leaves. As he opened his eyes, Master Ren continued the narrative. Hikaru encountered a wise old owl named Kasumi, who became his guide in the forest. Kasumi shared the importance of balance, the delicate dance between light and shadow. To improve oneself, one must find equilibrium in all aspects of life. The master's voice became a gentle murmur, mirroring the wisdom of Kasumi. Just as the owl sowed through the night, guided by the moon's glow, you must navigate the dualities of existence. Embrace both joy and sorrow, success and failure, for they are the threads that weave the tapestry of your being. Akira absorbed the lesson, contemplating the delicate balance required for self-improvement. Master Ren's eyes twinkled as he continued with the tale. Hikaru's journey led him to a mystical pond at the heart of the forest, where a koi fish swam against the current with unwavering determination. The koi taught him the value of perseverance. To improve oneself, one must swim upstream against the currents of complacency and adversity. The master's words flowed like the water in the story. Akira, picture the koi in your mind. Feel its strength, its resilience. Embrace challenges as opportunities for growth. Just as the koi transformed into a magnificent dragon, when it reached the waterfall summit, you too can undergo profound metamorphosis through perseverance. As Akira absorbed the imagery, Master Ren concluded the tale. And so young one, the tortoise, the owl, and the koi became symbols of wisdom, balance, and perseverance, the pillars of self-improvement. May their lessons guide you on your journey to becoming the best version of yourself. Akira opened his eyes, gratitude and determination gleaming in them. Master Ren, with a wise smile, whispered, The forest of tranquility awaits you, my student. Embrace the lessons of Hikaru, Kasumi, and the Koi, and you shall find the path to self-improvement. And so, with the echoes of the ancient tale resonating in his heart, Akira embarked on his journey, guided by the wisdom of the Zen master and the mystical creatures of the Forest of Tranquility. The mist-shrouded mountains stood witness to the timeless quest for self-improvement, as the young disciple embraced the ever-changing currents of life. Thank you for watching.